Friday we we all got together to go to one amazing and special place. So there's all kinds of party going on, food, all kinds of food. Because my friends get there, my brothers get there, and we all like to cook. So it's really good time. They have big speakers, we have music. It's a big deal. It's a big deal. Two years in a row they canceled because of COVID. You guys know COVID, right? Took a lot of time from us, you know what I mean? They cancel it, so now everybody's desperate and hungry for this event. We're all going there. Hi, my name is Leo. I'm, I'm 40 years old and I'm riding dirt bikes. It's my passion. Desert 100, it's one of the largest dirt bike race in the world. Fun fact, it's got the biggest single line start in a motorsport. One other fun fact, over just one weekend, about 8,000 people go through this sort of event. My cup of tea, it's, it's a single trials. And usually that's what I ride and I love hard enduro. And Desert 100, it's something different. It's a wide open space and a lot of whoops. And you gotta be mentally prepared for this. I've been in Odessa about six times before. I've never had enough balls. I've never had enough courage to do it. Luckily, a bunch of my friends support me. I'm moving forward. I'm gonna do it. Desert race. But it's pretty dusty here. And it's like you can be hitting rocks and it's pretty dangerous, but I'm willing to do it. I'm very excited. I'm all pumped up to do it. We're actually in line right now, pre-registered line, but I'm not even sure if they accept my application. I'm gonna take my chances. I'm gonna fight for it. Just because I'm a fighter. I got it. I have a big support group, guys. This is my support. This is my gas guy. This is our cook. Usually in our cooks with one leg, but we have one without the <laughs> But people, check it out. With strollers, with dogs. I'm telling you, like, entire family here. That's kind of my dream, to engage my family to this, but it's not working out yet. The vibe. It's all about vibe, bro. I mean, it's technically the energy. So many people here having a great time. And, you know, the, the weather is shitty. The whole condition is shitty. It's dusty, it's windy, but it doesn't ma matter, you know? You can't really wipe the wipe, you know? It's, it's, it's something. So we're making this video to encourage people, people like you, um, who's like not really sure if he wants to do it or not. I can truly tell you, do it. Do it. Because it really changed my life, and I'm sure it will change your life. I've met people through their bikes that becomes a strong relationship. Not only in their bike life, you know, we definitely ride together, but just in the everyday life, we become a great friends. Our family is tied together. I've met some other people through that. And by the way, one of them is actually making that movie right now. Pretty amazing people around the world. And, and you know, you'd say what their bike is. It's such a narrow path, but it explores you. It expands you in so many ways that you meet all kinds of people amazing people out there and I'm looking forward I'm looking forward to new relationships and new ideas and new things that I can discover through it
Dirt bike is life. Uh, man. Story of the life. Yeah, story of the... Hey, buddy! <laughs> I broke my ankle recently, and I had to sit on the couch for a month, and that was terrible, and I'm excited to be back. Excited to be here. My name is Will Gross, uh, 35 years old. I'm from Anacortes, Washington. This is my second uh, Stump Jumpers Desert 100. Uh, ever since that, I've been hooked. I've been racing the NMA series, off-road series, enduro series, NORC series. I uh, try to do a lot better than last time. Uh, I rode for 50 miles with a flat tire. I got my bibs on, my flex bars, uh, ready to rock and roll and kill this time. The goal when you race Desert 100 is always to win, but it's always also a, a big win just to finish. Uh, it's a pretty grueling 100 miles uh, going through the rocky, sandy desert. There's thousands of other riders. I should turn around and take a picture. Capture how I feel, I won't forget, yeah. Lord, I ain't got me in it, don't make sense, no. But that's what it's a champion me. meal, yeah. That's what you do, A little bit of bones, a little bit of meat. So you can kind of like look for it. the really tasty stuff. What do you want? Life will put me through it. That's just how it is. But God will get me through it. That's His promise. You know, I'm in a very stressful industry, working every day, eight to five, doing a customer service, but that's what makes me feel free. I'm definitely relaxed when I'm riding dirt bikes, and I'm definitely resting, and I'm feeling great, feeling amazing, and that's what gives me a conscience and love. Actually, I've been riding dirt bikes for about 12 years. It's all started up as I get together with my brothers. Because at one point, we got all married and got busy with the families. So we were like lost for about a year or two. And um, I bought myself a 125 TTR. Who knows that? It's a very small bike. And I've been riding at the back of my yard. So I've been riding this thing in the backyard and invite my brother. Says, let's do it, bro. Let's do it. So I got him in. And then my older brother got in, and since then we got all the kids in, and we got friends around, so it become a big deal. And we create almost a name of the group get together. It's like a Northwest Monomania. We, we're not well known, but it doesn't matter. Guys get together, having a great time, ride motorcycles as best knowledge, as best they can. We're fixing those motorcycles. Guys, it's just amazing. I can truly tell you, motorcycle is badass. Chairman and co-chairman have worked their asses off to get us here, and I want to acknowledge them. Mike Clough, the 2022 race chairman, Tom McIntosh, You want to say anything? I just am so happy to see all of you here. So it's been so much hard work between both of us and all of our uh, volunteers and club members this doesn't happen with just one person so thank you thank you for coming so, so he stole what I wanted to say no it's really just about thank you uh, it's awesome to see everybody here all you guys in my yard I've been here for a week just watched you arrive it's great thank you so much I see you. You have a trophy. Oh God, it's my daughter's. It's not me. I don't want to. Oh, where is she? Questions. Where is she? Right here. Come on over here. My name is Reese Scratcher, and the reason why I'm here just to have fun. Shane Butchart, we're here just to have some fun. 50th anniversary. 
Can't miss it. Josh Kramer and uh, here to run the 100 Odessa just to see if I can finish 100 miles in a day. Ryan Stevenson to race vintage tomorrow. Travis Bradshaw and I'm a rider. Uh, I'm a Desert 100 champion, past, previous champion. No, I'm not, I'm just a rider. Just here having fun, drinking beer. I'm Michael Selix. I'm here uh, the fourth time I was once in Odessa or out Advantage, come back 20 years later and I'm back on a dirt bike riding a TE-150 and an XE-125. That's, I'm out here to have fun, win, show myself I can do some things. 54. Well, my name is Taylor Crash Roberts, aka Superman. I started this about 10 years ago when my brother invited me. But I love dirt bikes, I love the Desert 100, I love the accomplishment, I love everything about it. The butterflies in your stomach. I ride dirt bikes because I love the feeling of getting into the zone with a machine and it's almost like you're bionic. That like when the machine becomes a part of you and just moves with you, it's just one of the one of the best feelings in the world. My name is Clay. Um, I'm from Seattle. Why do I do this? Because I love it. Uh, coming out, seeing all the people and uh, getting together with my family and spending some time. I got the best hand in poker. Well, I'm here because I'm racing. I'm here to sort of prove myself that I can do it. I'm here to have this amazing energy. I'm here just to have a good time and do the race. It truly really doesn't matter what you're doing. At some point, some people can say it's dangerous. Hey guys, life is dangerous. You can die from it. <laughs> but you know, what if, what if you're doing things you love? What if you're doing things you're happy with? Isn't it the best thing you can live through? Isn't it the best experience you can like, you can live through and enjoy while you're living this life? It doesn't have to be dirt bikes, it could be anything. But find your passion, what really completes you. Give you a bunch of friends that your kids looking for the purpose. So whatever you think, it's amazing, it's gonna give you this fix, you know, and a good feeling. And I can truly tell you, go for competition. Because that's what's really, really check who you are. And your skill level, and what you got, and what you accomplished so far. Do it. You're gonna remember me in a good way. You will. Today is the day, and I'm ready to win. I'm Matt Salman with Adventure Medics. Uh, we're here to support this race for the next couple days. Um, just to, if there's any accidents in the field, our crew's gonna go get them. We have about 
Oh, seven UTVs, 13 medics out here, a mobile medical base. Uh, plus we're working with Odessa EMS and Protection One's down here with their ambulances. So we have four ambulances here total. I got to give it out to, you know, the Stump Jumper Safety Group are awesome. They really care about their, their people here. And that's why they brought us in and all these other ambulance services. Well, today is a, it is an amazing day. I actually, I, I, I made it or I completed to what I came for. I'm so tired, I'm so exhausted, but I'm so happy that I did it. I actually completed a hundred miles a race, Desert 100, and the bike performed amazingly. It was a little couple of crushes, but uh, the, the, I got a flood, so I still made it, made it happen. Uh, oh my gosh, Odessa 100 finisher. I don't even know what place I am. I think I'm pretty good. But this is what matters to me. I actually did it. Check on my bucket list. <laughs> Makes me happy. <laughs> this is my story. <laughs> I came here not to be first. Why not? But I mean, I came here to actually participate in this amazing event and to put my stamp in it like I did it <laughs> you know what guys I encourage you do it you'll never regret
You're asking me Desert 100, right? <laughs> Desert 100. It's one of the largest dirt bike in the race. <laughs> Fun fact, it's got the biggest <laughs> single line start. <laughs> <laughs> what the f is this in 100? It's a lot of vodka. <laughs> it's a drunk people. So much fun. No, this is 100. It's one of the largest dirt bike races in the world. Yeah. It's pretty f large. <laughs> <laughs> One of the largest.